Welcome to DevConf 20 Online. Welcome to DevConf 20 Online. Willkommen auf der DevConf 20 Online. Welcome DevConf 20 Online. Bienvenido al DevConf 20 en línea. Sejam bem-vindos e bem-vindas a DevConf 20 Online. Welcome to DevConf 20 Online. Wir sind heute auf DevConf20 online. 2020 hat ein crazy year. Es hat uns alle unsere Leben upside down. Aber das also bedeutet, dass wir eine Rückkehr zur Normalität und lange Zeit mit unseren Debian Freunden verbringen, mit Ideen zu lösen, mit technischen und sozialen Problemen zu lösen und vielleicht ein bisschen Mao in der Evening. Every year, we try to bring DevConf to a different part of the world to connect to a new local community and share the responsibility for organizing it with a new team. This year, we were planning to host DevConf 20 in Haifa, Israel, but we've had to postpone that to next year, or maybe even 2022. We'll see how things look early in the year. Instead, we're going to have to hold this online, which is going to be different. We are mostly attending from home, spread across time zones, But that also gives us an opportunity to bring new parts of our community into the conference. So, we've got two non-English mini-confs as part of the schedule. A Spanish-language mini-conf with slots around midday in Latin America, and a Malayalam-language mini-conf with slots in the afternoon and early evening in India. First of all, we would like to thank our sponsors, Hosting DevConf would not be possible without our sponsors. We'd like to thank our platinum sponsors, Lenovo, Infomaniac, Google, and Amazon Web Services. Our gold sponsors, Deepin, Matanel, Collabora, and Hudson River Trading. Silver sponsors, Linux Professional Institute, Civil Infrastructure Platform, Canonical, and Roche. And our bronze sponsors, IBM, MySQL, and Univention. We would like to remind everyone that attendees are required to follow both the DevConf Code of Conduct and the Debian Code of Conduct. This can be found at devconf.org. If you notice behavior that fails to meet this standard, please speak up and help to keep DevConf as re respectful as we expect it to be. If you are harassed and requests to stop are not successful, or you notice a dis disrespectful environment, the organizers want to help. You can find contact information for incident response in the DebConf20 website. How is remote DebConf going to work? Not that differently from an in-person DevConf. There are talks, boffs, sprints, some social events, and a hallway track. Social spaces for people to have unscheduled conversations, technical or not. As always, everything is streamed on the internet and recordings will be available later. Many of the talks are pre-recorded, but there will be live Q&A at the end of the talk, and some talks will be given live. Group discussions, boffs, will be done through Jitsi video conferences and streamed over the internet. Notes will be shared via Etherpad. Real-time communication will be on IRC. Discussions also happen on mailing lists, but more slowly. Jitsi is also there for casual conversations and discussions that aren't on the schedule. The schedule is available at the DevConf20 website and is available in your local time zone as well. Sprints are moments of concentrated effort organized by teams to work in their respective areas of Debian, and some of them are planned during DebConf in parallel with the talks. For general interaction with other DebConf attendees, use our IRC channel, hash DebConf on OFTC. We also have the hash DC20-talks channel for discussion related to the talks as they are happening. We recommend you to use a proper IRC client, but you can also use the OFTC web chat client, which is linked from the streaming page. Each talk has a shared notes document for questions and collaborative note taking. 
The link for each talk is available in the streaming page when the talk is happening and also on the talk page. Both are our discussion sessions. If you want to be an active participant in the discussion, you need to have the Jitsi call link. Talk to the session organizer to get it. To join Jitsi from a mobile device, you need to install the Jitsi mobile app. It's also possible to dial into Jitsi over the phone system if you have a poor internet connection, but that may be an expensive international call. If you would like to just watch the POF sessions, follow the regular conference streaming. Jitsi doesn't work very well with hundreds of people in the call. Under 20 is much more reasonable. We've had a little bit of practice with this approach to online conferences at the recent MiniDevCoff Online, but we're de definitely still learning and relying on lots of brand new systems that have a lots of bugs, so please be patient if we run into trouble. On that note, we would like to thank all of the volunteers who have helped to make DevConf 20 online possible. It's been a bit of a scramble in the last few months to get this together, and I am proud of what we have got done, but this is not over yet. During the conference, we will need volunteers to help with several tasks. You can sign up for tasks on the DevConf 20 website. You don't need to have experience in these tasks. The video team can train you to help out. But you will need a decent internet connection. Thanks for watching and enjoy DevConf 20. Thanks for watching and enjoy DevConf 20. Thank you fürs Einschalten und viel Spaß auf der DevConf 20. Ella Rakum Nandi. DevConf Gracias por acompañarnos. Disfruta el DevConf 20. Obrigado por assistir. E aproveite a DevConf 20. Tack för att du tittar och hoppas du ska njuta av Webcom 20. Alla mina är det köpande, det är ni, så jag är det webcom 20.